So Joel, um, welcome to Saracens first of all. Um, we've seen you around a, a couple of weeks. How did the move first come about? Um, well, obviously, uh, I had a good good few years at Exeter and sort of enjoyed it as my sort of local um, Premiership club. And then, kind of different things happen. Sort of, I think it's uh, nice to have a bit of a change and sort of a new challenge, so to speak. So, uh, obviously, got in touch with Saracens and uh, come up and had a look around, and obviously, really sort of impressed with how everything works and sort of the coaches and the players and stuff. And it's been the same the first couple of weeks that like everyone's been uh, really welcoming. Um, it's been it's been real good fun. There's um, a few a few boys you know um, from from England in the twenties. Um, have they helped you get get settled in a little bit? Uh, yeah, I was, uh, uh, obviously Marrow and Nick Tompkins and stuff were away when I first got here. Um, but a couple of lads that I live with, I know, and obviously the others that I didn't know, I've got to know pretty quick, and they've helped me out, sort of telling me where where to be and sort of what what sort of what happens. And like I said, the staff have been excellent as well. So like Paddy, the conditioner been real sort of helpful just making sure everyone knows what they're doing sort of where we're going each day so it's been it's been a really sort of easy transition we've seen um the last few days a few um pre-seasons stepping up a little bit um, how are you finding those conditioning games and, and conditioning ah it's always tough you get a bit, bit of a burn on but uh no it's been good it's been enjoyable as well so everyone works hard in like in a competitive game it's not just sort of running around aimlessly so it's, it's been fun tough but fun kind of thing and that's exactly what pre-season noises so part of it I guess. And what are your personal ambitions going into this, uh, this season? It's obviously a long, long pre-season yeah. as well. Yeah obviously it's, gonna, it's sort of a bit different with the World Cup this year. Um, I think I'll probably be playing at Bedford um, a bit as well so my season might start in sort of a more traditional style. Um, so the, uh, the idea this year is just to try and play as much as I can, improve sort of on and off the field and the gym stuff as well and obviously the end goal trying to be to play as much Premiership rugby here as I can and sort of see where that takes me.